Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of Deck and Around Deck Specs. Today we're going to be taking a look at the False Anchor playing cards. But before we jump into it, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. And ding a -ling. So this deck is printed by USPCC on their classic stock, utilizing their magic finish. It is part of an unspecified print run and it retails for $9.95. So let's take a look. So I have to say, I really like the simplicity of the front of this tuck. I think it's really cool that it has like a net pattern to it with the anchor on it. And then all of the, like all of the coloring is like a very like sea foam kind of green. You can see that ad copy on the bottom there, falseanchors.com by Ryan Schultz. And then you have this beautiful back design, which mimics what's on the back of the cards, though not exactly. You'll also notice that on the back there, it says the secret lies with the lady. So one of the interesting things I think about this deck is that there's a hidden kind of scavenger hunt within, within it, which if you go check out Ryan Schultz's uh, Instagram, I think there's more information on it. But I have to say, I love the color on this deck. I think it's absolutely spectacular. You have two... So, such a nice color. Absolutely. So you have two matching jokers there, and the one thing that I actually didn't show in this is that second joker actually has an ace of hearts on the back. Um, being a magician's deck and really priced as a worker's deck, it's standard across the courts pips and you know everything for the most part other than the jokers and the gaff cards but it really feels nice in hand it fans really well i've never dealt with a deck that had that magic finish on it before so there is a slight you know a little bit of a little more glide to it versus you know a standard air cushion deck but it still feels really comfortable in hand um springs really nicely yeah, I mean, look at that. And that color is just spectacular. It really is. You don't see very many decks that color, you know? It's like an interesting teal, but it really pops off in such a way that a lot of the other teal decks that we've seen recently didn't manage to do. So I think... You know, you know what it looks like it reminds me of? is kind of like the sea, the color of the sea in some of these tropical islands. Absolutely. They really nailed it. Absolutely. Sure. No, I think it really did a nice job with it. So the one difference too between what you saw on the tuck where it says the secret lies with the lady, which I think I, I'm assuming is probably one of the first clues in this little scavenger hunt with the deck. And then the back is the back, the, the, uh, the banners actually say perception is reality, which is really kind of cool. Like I like the little touches to this, the fact that it really is designed as a magic deck. And then as you saw in the video too, the two gaff cards in the back there are basically a two of clubs with one of the indices and pips replaced with the ace of hearts, and then an ace of hearts with one of the indices replaced with a two of clubs. So I'm sure there's a bunch of gaffs you could use that for, but as a worker's deck at 995, this thing really is a great handling, great looking deck that isn't so far off the beaten path as to raise any sort of suspicion from a spectator. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah and 995 you can't go wrong, yeah, right? Absolutely. I mean, for what yeah. this is at 995, you'll get a lot of good use out of this thing. Yeah, and fans of False Anchors version one, you know, if you have that book, you definitely uh add this to the collection and and you know use it absolutely. beyond that. Who knows if a version three will come out. We'll have to keep an eye out, hopefully. Thanks everyone for uh checking out this episode of Deck Around Deck Specs. Make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We drop these every Tuesday, Friday, and Saturday, so make sure to keep an eye out.